want to do it though. You need it right away. The insurance company was got probes was leaking right there. I'll send it out tonight. All right. Cool. Well, that was definitely leaking right there. Top element. You guys, I'm draining this tank out. The element was leaking right from the plastic. It was dripping right off the right off the plastic. So. That's gonna be. I'm draining it. I gotta change it. I owned out the bottom one. I'm okay with the bottom one. As soon as we drain it down enough, the power is off. I checked that the brake is off. Change that top element. It's not that old. Four years old. Break is trapped and I'll shut the power off also. Give my coat here so I don't if it drips. I don't know the place. Look at that, you can see it split. See it split? That's why it's leaking. <coughs> There's a special a special wrench to take that off with. See the element's gonna split right in. That's pretty that's definitely different. That would definitely trip the breaker. And plus it was leaking. This insulation's all wet. It was leaking right out the I wish I had better light, but it was it was leaking right there out that stem, out the plastic, and then running down. It wasn't leaking from the o-ring because the water was coming inside the element. That's supposed to be sealed. Pretty cool. I'm thinking that top element, that top control is still good. I just got to get another element. We're going to try it. I believe I have one in the truck. I might. We'll see. I should have the rating right here. Then 4,500 volts.